Hey everyone, it's Calvin, also known as Wormer, and this is my first ever playthrough of Super Mario Odyssey. A lot of stuff has happened here. Look, the ice is gone. This place looks absolutely amazing. I think the colors are gorgeous. Uh, it's clearly based on Mexico, right? And, like, there's a lot of, like, iconography from, like, stuff that would be considered, like, Mexican, but I guess... Oh, the music is really cool. But I guess you guys can correct me on that if I'm wrong. If I am wrong, I'll totally admit it. Look at this man here. He looks like Chris Hemsworth's brother. Uh, not Liam Hemsworth. Ah, uh, taxi, taxi, you pulled up finally. Take me to Metro Kingdom. What? Is he a sim? Sorry about the holdup. Had some car trouble, you know. You would not believe. Can't leave for Metro Kingdom yet, though. I promise I'll get you there. Just, uh, gotta de- uh, de the everything. de the everything? Okay, can I talk to you? <laughs> what? <laughs> Someone told me that I can talk to the human, uh, but I guess maybe it's only when he's in the ice or something like that. That's my bad if it is. Um, let's get to 25 so we can get that. Oh, we're so close to 25. The music sounds like it's coming from a radio as well. Oh, we can get a moon here as well, which is great. There's still one of those little things hiding around here. There's a lot of things we can do here. Uh, one of the things I kind of want to do is go back into the pit because I'm pretty sure we missed something. And I was trying to see... I love that, like, it's not fully melted yet. I was so sick of the cold. Me too. Me too. Uh, one of the things I really liked... Wait, can we hit these now? About uh, this game uh, was that... Or one of the things I really like is that when I can go back and edit... I can look at, like, stuff and be like, oh, that's what I miss, you know what I mean? And some people may say that's cheating. Well, why do I have... Well, that's the benefit of, of having, you know, me my own editor. You know, that's the benefit. Let's just go back into the pit. It won't take too long to get around. We know exactly how to get around the place. We're not looking to do all the extra stuff like jumping up on those Goombas anymore. Oh, we have this music here as well. This is really good. I Like, you can travel on Jaxi, and that's fine. But to me, like, it doesn't take that long to- Wait, there's also this- Wait! Hold on a second. Hold on one second. The pit is just open now where the guy's head was. How are you doing, buddy? Want to explore in front of payment? Oh, no, I'm okay. Thank you so much, though. Thank you so much. I do want to go into the pit, though. To the pinnacle. Will they let me go back into the pit? I, I, I think that you can rematch this boss, but... There's something I have to do first, and that is, there's a place I know where all the cool people go. And look, we'll do this in like three seconds, because like we're, we're masters of this now. Look, look at this. I also need the cowboy outfit, so if anyone, anyone knows how to get the another one of these uh, purple coins, that'd be great. That's all I want is... Uh, that's all I want is, is just a cowboy outfit. Is that too much to ask? No, it's not. It's not too much to ask. Just a simple cowboy outfit. Oh, 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 oh! Not what I intended to do, but look. It saved my life. <laughs> you guys can't even jump up here, so don't even try it. You can jump up here if I command you to, but not, not if I don't let you. Yeah, it's up here. See around there? That's where we have to go. I was wondering how we got up to that place. It's like right there. And I only saw it during editing. Now, I do want to make this playthrough, like, enjoyable for absolutely everybody. I'm not, like, you know, going to be, like, a dictator when it comes to a lot of this stuff, too. Um, I understand that you guys have to enjoy it, and I have to enjoy it. So, like, if you guys think it's a good idea to look over spaces and be like, Ooh, maybe I should have done this, maybe I should have done that. Or if you guys t want me to just do it even, even more natural, just let me know. Uh, because I can have fun either way. Uh, but really, I, did, I wasn't, like, scouring this. I just kind of found it as I was editing. Oh, it's just coins. You kidding me? Like, like that's not even worth it. I just want purple coins. Oh, there's a chest over here, though, which means probably a moon. Oh my god, this is sick. This is disgusting. In a good way. But how do we get up in this thing? Oh. <laughs> Me trying to do the backflip? Okay. Really cool, really cool. 
This game has just been like enjoyable from start to finish. We have another moon, which is great. I probably should have gotten the three lives if I'm going back in here, like the extra lives you can get. So cool. I know there's everything about this game is just so cool. And like it's so smooth, it's so much fun to play. Like there's not a moment where I'm like, oh man, I have to do this or I have to do that. It's actually just really, really cool all the time. Music is also like really cool. Not the music, but like the, the, the vibe. I do like like crystal type caves. I'm a big fan of crystal caves, you know what I mean? What's this? Oh, we have to probably adopt this. What? Wait a second, there's coins up there too! We did fly really far, how did you know? How do we get those coins? Wait, what if we have to change the direction in which we go in? One second here. What do we have to like change the no that doesn't make any sense? Oh! Oh, hello! And that's such a oh my god, that's such a weird thing to like find here. Hold on a second, everybody. Now look what I'm doing. And we can shoot coins as well. I feel like I feel like maybe you can rematch this boss because I did hear you could rematch the boss, but I'm wondering if it's just like in a specific moment or time. No, you can only go this way. How do we get those coins then? This game is lying to me. Okay, maybe I heard it wrong. Maybe I heard it wrong that you can rematch a boss. I don't know. We'll go back down here and we'll go through the pipe. Uh, we have other stuff to do anyway. We have a lot of stuff to do. Um, like I said a million times over, I'm in no rush to beat this game. I'm in no rush to finish this game. Uh, there's no... Ah! 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 I don't know why I did that. I'm in no rush to beat this game. I'm in no rush to finish this game. Um, the next game we're playing after this is Tears of the Kingdom, which is going to be a monster playthrough, by the way. That whole playthrough, we're not doing a single thing. A single, not a single thing will be done off camera. The last, uh, Breath of the Wild last time when I played it, um, we did a lot off camera. We did a whole lot off camera. Because I felt like it was too long. Um, but I think a lot of the times, like, you know, the best playthroughs to do on the channel are the ones that, like, we just, like, do everything. We just do as much as we can until we, like, collapse. I think it's always the best thing. You guys said maybe these guys have to... No, I'm not going in there. Couldn't jump in if I wanted to. Maybe we do. I just have to jump in here. I know this is the exact same place, right? This is where the head was. Deep is under... Yeah, maybe... I don't know. I don't know. Maybe there is a way to... to, to maybe later on we have, like, a rematch or something like that. Um... I tend to not, like, listen all the time to, like, comments that, like, say, like, hey, you can go back and do this, go like this, but it's just, like, usually if there's stuff that I'm gonna miss, I usually go, like, okay, maybe I should do this. Um, but look, if we're not gonna miss it, we're not gonna miss it. If there's- Oh, there's some purple coins! We found them! We have to go up top! Oh, yeah, gonna get the cowboy effort! yippee ki -yay. You'll never guess what I've been! So there's some ice over there that melted, too, I'm guessing. We can fast travel there as well. Oh, we could probably do the hop jump up there. No, we could not. We definitely could not. I don't think we could. Let's try it, though. Jesus loves a trier. I also appreciate people saying uh, that they enjoy, that they, they, they feel like, you know, I am super, super happy during this playthrough. And there is a lot of happiness during this playthrough. Uh, there is a, a, a boatload of happiness during this playthrough because it's just like a really smooth game to play. We're getting the cowboy of it, boys! And by the way, when I say boys, if you're new here, that's gender neutral. Everyone's boys. Nice little heart as well, I'll take that. Um, I'm trying to remember what- like, how do you get the- the, the chest over here? Like, that's- that's confusing. Like, is it possible to get the chest over here? How do you get that- that one over there? Oh, the- wait, are the pictures- are the pictures ready yet? No way. Are the pictures ready? 
Let's check. Because I remember the pictures. Remember, we couldn't go into the pictures just yet. They are ready. Wait, what the hell? What the hell? Wait, what is that? What is that? Why? That's like a city. Why, why are we going here? Is this like a new world? Is this a whole new world? What is that? Is this a different kingdom? There's a city! And we got the secret path to New Donk City. Okay, I think I've actually genuinely like, actually like, probably seen stills of this before. But it's still so cool to see. Look at that! We're gonna get to explore here later. Oh my god. I think that's the only way, I think it's the only thing we can do here right now. But still though, like that's so sick. Skip this, we don't need to see this again. I can't wait. I can't wait to go there. Um, I like, how do we get up there? That's, that's, that's the main thing. And there's also like, how do we get up on top of this as well? Life's, oh, maybe it's the rocket. Let's go get the rocket. Let's go get the rocket. Also, there's like an acorn around here if you guys have seen one. Lizard! If you guys have seen one, let me know. But also, we're going to go by the cowboy outfit. Because it's time. It's time. And there's a Koopa over here with a freaking sombrero as well. Dude, why aren't you joining the party, dude? Come over here and let's talk. Oh, and the ice is also melted in the hotel resort. That's not a hotel resort. Hello. Hey, dude. You up for a challenge? Always. Everyone knows walking, right? Problem is, most don't take it seriously. That's what trace walking is all about. If you can walk like a champion, win a prize. Wanna try? Sure. Sweet! Oh, it's trace walking. Oh, no! <laughs> Here's the fun part, though. The arrows disappear after a bit. You gotta score any points uh, more to win. Let's go. Watch this. Trace walking, 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 trace walking. I've already failed. I've already failed. Should have got a good look at this. Should have got a good look at this. Should have got a good look at this. Should have got a good look. Oh, here we go. So I'm just gonna walk along this way. It's actually along this way. Trace Walkin. Trace Walkin. Trace Walkin. <laughs> 20 points! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh no, I'll do it, I'll do it this time. Let's go. Let's go. One, two. So it's around the cactus. Oh, guys, I kind of see a faint line here. Okay. Okay. That's better, right? That's that's at least two points. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good. Okay, that was way better that time. Zero points. <laughs> he was like, you're a freaking idiot. <laughs> I'll take that. You think it was a nerd price? No, I'm, f I'm fine. Thank you so much. Th that moon is all I need. Thank you so much, brother. Okay. Wait, no. We should get the cowboy outfit as soon as possible and then go to the uh, hotel resort. I know it's not a hotel resort, but it's what I'll always see it as now. But we're going to go there anyway. Why am I going this way? I think I just like the the, the 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 spirit of it. It's so cool seeing the change, by the way, in this place. And that's something that Sunshine did so well. I loved when the world got so much brighter as you were going through the game. Hey, there it is. I'll take this. I'll take that. Cowboy outfit. Yeah. Change now. Howdy, partner. This boy from Oklahoma. <laughs> Never taken off this outfit, hell no. Put him up. Put him up, partner. Where's my guns? 
We have them hidden because this, uh, this is a kid's game. You know what I'm talking about? Pow, pow. Gonna shoot you. That's what cowboys say, right? Okay, let's go to the resort now. I'm so happy now. The little cowboy outfit. He looks like Woody <laughs> from Toy Story. <laughs> but if it, Woody was shorter. Okay. <laughs> the shuffle on the sand as well. Oh, and there's also a uh, Lakaluku. Lakalutu? Lakaliki? Lakalutu. I'm going swimming now, I'll tell you that much. See you later. We collected a lot of these. Not enough, though. Not enough. Do you have uh, anything I have to do? Like, is there a fishing prize? Well, it's time for fishing. Is it time for fishing? Yeah. Raise the line. Wait, come over here now. Hey! Come out of the water there. Bite! Bite this, I see you! Oh, hope no one bites my wine. Oh, it'd be such a shame. Oh. Be such a shame if someone bit this wine here. Oh, it's just a little wine. Oh. Oh, it's when they vibrate. Okay. Oh, just to shine on the sea. Be such a shame if someone bit the wine. Oh, he got scared when I moved too fast. Oh, it'd be such a shame if someone bit onto this wine. Hey, how do you do this? You know what? This game is, this game is trash. Oh, it'd be such a shame. You're mine. You're mine. What do we caught? Oh, we caught a piranha plant. On a moon? Serious? Fishing in the oasis, is that like, wait. Did I just automatically catch the best one or something? Be such a shame if someone was to bite this. Wouldn't be very nice on me. I just need this wine for 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 to, to do nothing with it. I'm not even trying anything. Hey. Okay. Oh, just moving my wine over here, over to this little fish. Hey, that did vibrate. It vibrated. It vibrated. Get the shine off the water. I want to catch a fish. I need to see if there's more moons in here. Hey, you over here. Did you ever hear of uh, fishing? It would be such a shame if someone was to... Oh. Oh. Okay, so it is... I just automatically caught, went for the biggest fish, which makes sense, I guess. Okay. Well, we better go then. What do you say? What just happened? You don't need to know. What, what do you say? You, you go back? Oh, back, back to it. Time of vision. Yeah, you, you, you do that, brother. You do that. Okay, so now I'm gonna go to the rocket because I want to go to the rocket. Uh, there's also that up there. There's lots of like things on platforms. There's like lots of like little uh, things that we can probably do. But the rocket has been appealing to me for a long time. I can't believe this human doesn't have anything to do though. Like what? Like what's? You're telling me the human can't give me anything? Oh. What? That that had a that all all this time had a freaking. All this time? Wait. Wait, are we serious? That's what this had all the time? I didn't realize. So like the bird over there, I can see it in the distance, is one of those two, and the bird over there was probably one too? Beat the launch. Where are we going to? Wait! 
I thought the rock was gonna... Oh, okay, I thought the rock was gonna do something completely different. Scarecrow time. This is awesome. This is awesome. This is what I always wanted from a video game. I love this type of stuff. This is like floodless levels, but easy. <laughs> Calvin, you don't know if it's easy yet. You're right. I'm about to die. <laughs> is what I would say if I was gonna die. <laughs> Calvin doesn't die in Mario levels anymore. But Calvin, what about the the level where you did die? Oh, you mean that level? That never happened. But Calvin, I saw you die in that. I'm, I'm so scared. <laughs> I saw you die in that level, Calvin. Oh, you didn't though. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You didn't see me die. That's funny how we both remember things differently. You want to come over here? Hey, buddy over there. Look what happened there. I have an idea. Oh, my God. Now I'm on top of this building. There must be something secret to this, build to this, to this building. Like these little coins here. Oh, my God. That's so dangerous. I love it. This is the best thing ever! Being the master of the floodless levels in like Mario Sunshine has prepared me for this completely. Like there's nothing that could scare me anymore. Like literally nothing. There's no like like there's nothing about these levels that scare me at all because of the floodless stuff. <laughs> there's like literally not a, a thing. But now I'm just like, can we go to a strange neighborhood? Re it's a really cool location. I wonder what's do don't leave it on me. Oh, you left? Oh, because he was on- was he on that thing the whole time? That's interesting. And we're back here. I thought the rocket was gonna take us all the way up there. Which I'm guessing now we have to do a lot more exploring to get those the little things. Wait. I thought he's dancing. No, he's not dancing. There's also a direct line from the tower to here, which means I think we have to go back up the tower. And that's how we get that moon. What do you guys say? What do you guys say, huh? I oh, y'all agree with me, I'd say. Take that. What happens? Who knows? Roasty, toasty, sunny. I'm surprised that this taxi driver does not talk to us at all. What if I get in the taxi? What if I grant have thought it was taxi? He just doesn't want to talk to me at all. Maybe it's because I bonked him on the head. Dude, we all get bonked in the head sometimes. Like, stop acting like you're special. We all, like, I, I got bonked in the head 15 times last week. Wait, we can just go up to the top of the tower, can't we? Yep, no point in, like, warping. Yeah, that's actually really cool. Fast travel is really cool. Now I see the use. Who are you? <laughs> I'm traveling all over the galactic lad from all the house places. This spot looks pretty good for a blood pump and power dive, scurry. <laughs> Wait, we can glide with him? This is Spyro time? Oh my god. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> this is the best. Oh, we're not, we're, we're not gonna. Okay. <laughs> Let's go back up. So sorry, buddy. <laughs> you can be back up here when I come up. This is awesome. But we're gonna have to master this, I suppose. This is how we get some of these, um... This is how we get that, the chest. Just a simple glide. We don't have to do anything special. And now we can fast travel here if needed. Dude, look at that. Look at that. We got that. And now we get these two chests. One is the coins, and one is a moon. Okay, great. We got treasure of the Jaxi runes. That's a Jaxi rune. Okay, and under all, for some reason, like he's he's also here for some reason. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do as well? I'm gonna fast travel. Sorry, two players. I'm gonna fast travel back up to here, and we're gonna see if we can get any more. Because I think there's one moon we can get that like uh, I think is pretty obvious. Um, so we got that one, which is cool. No, I don't wanna go on this. Um, was there one down here? I don't think there was. There was melted ice over here, though, so maybe there's something to do with that over there. We could check it out. 
There's also a block over there that we still don't know what they do. Uh, I won't be going back to them anyways, so they can go away with themselves. Okay, let's go. I think it's this one. Perfect. Okay, let's land perfectly here, okay? Ha! Huh. Oh, we didn't need to land perfectly. Okay, on the lone pillar. Still though. <laughs> Look at the little dance, watch. <laughs> okay, uh, where do we go next? Uh, is there anyone else we can go on this guy? I think I think we're I think with all those moons are pretty much sorted. There's one more. There's one over there, uh, which we're gonna fast travel tonight right now actually. Freaking ten out of ten game, guys. This is like this is like the this is. Like, for me, Mario Sunshine... Can we, like, slide on this? Can we glide on this? Oh, yeah, you can move from... I forgot about this. Yeah, I forgot about those things. All together. Uh, cool. Another little, uh... I'm trying to think if there's any other moons we can get here. Like, the ice is... Oh, look at that down there! Ha! Ha ha! Let's go. I, s I saw a secret door there. I'm so glad you're all enjoying the playthrough as well. Uh, to see some genuine enthusiasm about like a really freaking fun game is always really cool. Uh, oh, look at this. And it activates a little shortcut for us. Not that we ever needed the shortcut. In fact, I think the shortcut needed us more than we needed him. I wonder if there's anything up here we can get. There's that line up there that we can go all the way over there. Uh, I think we're going to do that at some point. Yeah. Oh, there definitely is. Yeah, there definitely is a bunch of like little lines we can go to here. But first of all, there's a little chasm over here with a doorway, I think. Ah! Tried to trick me. <laughs> me. It's, it's trying to trick me. And it's like the easiest thing in the world. Um... I guess what I'm saying is, guys, before we go any further, I'm super grateful always for the support on my videos. The fact that anyone wants to watch my stuff is insane. You know what I mean? The fact that anyone wants to... Okay. Prince of Persia, this thing. I did a wall jump. You don't have to give me the tutorial for it. What is this? Oh! So we can take a look. Oh, okay. That's pretty... Wait, what's... Why give us... Hold on a second now. Why give us this one though? What's through here? Is this just the exit? Oh, this is the exit, yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay. So we can hop over here like this, first of all. Which is terrifying. And then... Oh my god, Calvin! I'm not even gonna try it, watch this. We could've tried it. It would've worked. It would've worked. We could've jumped over there pretty easily, actually, because we could've gauged where it was. There's also a moon over here. Oh, this is an easy one. So this one, this here, and that there. Okay, that, that's an easy one. We got the moon, but hold on a second. And then we just go in here. Oh, that was a good, that was a good one. That was a really fun one. Really, really fun. Uh, and then we also have to go up here to the little power line. Man, this is so good! <sighs> like, how fun is it just finding all these little extra things? Like, I think that's like one of the, like, the only... Oh, there's also one up there. How do we get to that? No one knows. Uh, I think one of the only criticisms I ever have of, like, Sunshine, I'm saying only because, like, to me, guys, Sunshine is legit, like, to me, the second greatest platformer ever created after Spyro 2. Uh, and Spyro 2, to me, is, like, the pinnacle, the absolute pinnacle of, of, um, these type of games. Can we just walk across this? 
is the absolute pinnacle of um well, there's like a little thing in there as well with a moon as well there's a moon in here too we have to figure out how to get in there as well we'll figure it out to me it's the absolute pinnacle of of these types of games and to me to be a fun game to be a fun platformer in my opinion and not that my opinion matters much as a person who didn't play many platformers as a kid. Um, but to me, to be a good platformer, like, the extra stuff needs to be just as fun as the main stuff. It just has to be. And, like, one of my main weirdo criticisms of Super Mario Sunshine when I was playing Super Mario Sunshine uh, was always like... Oh, yeah, roll. Was always, uh... We're gonna get it. Was always that like you, the extra, extra stuff was so much fun, and then you got to a certain point where it was like, oh, it's kind of not anymore, right? You know, like it's like it's kind of this is really difficult for me. I know people might say, well, Calvin, that seems like a you problem, and 100% it is. 100% <laughs> it is another extra dungeon here as well. I wonder if this is gonna be one of the dungeons that has two moons inside it. Okay, one second here. Uh! But in this game, I feel like the extra stuff, by default, is just, like, so much fun. And I, I here's the thing. I don't think they made Sunshine ever with the intention of being like, this is going to be overly difficult or this is going to be super difficult. I think one of the worst complaints that anyone can have... There's some, something cool in here, isn't there, that I missed? I think one of the worst complaints that anyone can have... Oh, about... Um any game is that oh the devs were, were just being assholes it, you hear it all the time about like you know games like uh you know Sekiro or Dark Souls of Bloodborne uh you hear it about like classic horror games I like some like nothing turns me off a streamer quicker and I'm saying this now nothing turns me off a streamer quicker than when I am freaking watching their stream and they say stuff like the developer like is an asshole for doing this level and it's like, the developer, regardless of what you think, wants everyone to enjoy their game. There's not an ounce of, like, uh, like, like now, now, some developers might be assholes, like, for sure. But, like, usually, like, when they're making a game, they want people to enjoy it. And back in the day, when Sunshine came out, and, like, Silent Hill 3 came out, and Silent Hill 2, and, like, the original RE games, which are still freaking amazing games. Resident Evil Remake's perfect. Like... There was a different, like, mentality when it came to games. There's different mindsets when it came to games. Like, you know, the mentality that we have now about video games is a very modern one, which is, like, everything has to be kind of smooth, you know. And that's that's in terms of... Oh, my God. That's in terms of, like, the mainstream, right? Like, you know, um, I know people who will legit... Like, who don't play games all the time, but will legit, like, quit a game if it's too hard. Um, which to me is always very unfortunate, but that's just the way some people play. Some people like to play games so casually, which is fine. You can play games in whatever way you want. Uh, that like, they will just be like, oh, this game is like not worth my time anymore. Um, so people design games, so they're a little bit more accessible, which accessibility is also <laughs> can be good, you know? I feel like, you know, it's always like a hornet's nest jumping in on this conversation because it's a very heated topic sometimes online when it shouldn't be. Sometimes it's just like, hey man, some people like... Tougher games, some people like nicer games. Like, I always, like, really dislike when people say games are supposed to be relaxing. Uh, when I think, th when I think that there's a room for both, you know what I mean? There's room for both types of games. I guess what I'm saying is, this game's super fun. <laughs> and classic games like Super Mario Sunshine are also super fun, but obviously they show their age sometimes. But I still think Sunshine holds up, like, incredibly well. I love that game. So, is this one of the areas that has a, that has two different things in here? Is that what's gonna happen here? Yeah, it doesn't seem like it is. Okay, uh, you know, it, it's not a secret area, I suppose. I wonder if the other secret area has it as its own as a second thing, though. I don't know. It's hard to know, isn't it? It's hard to know which one is the second thing, which one isn't. Can we get back up on top of this thing, or do we have to go all the way over here again? I guess we don't have to go all the way over here. Man, the fact that like this is thirty coins though, just for one round trip. Like, take that. Legit, like, the easiest thing in the world. Okay, I want to go back up on this thing as well. There's a few more moons we have to get anyway, so I want to go back up on this thing. Like, I saw another moon there as well. 
There's also a moon up there, which I'm not sure how to get either. I wonder if it does have something to do with, like, the gliding. We'll see. I think the best way to approach video games, though, before we go into, like, a whole conversation about this all the time, uh, the best way to approach video games for me is just, like, you know, play what makes you happy. And to me, like, uh, this type of game is, like, perfect because it's, like, always, like, a slight bit of challenge with, like, you know, a lot of fun colors and beautiful scenery. You know, then you can play a game like, like a, like a more difficult game that's considered more difficult. Wait, do we have to give a sheep back again? I wonder if we have to, if we give a sheep back again, will he give us something? That might be a thing. Oh my god, we're going right back up to the top of the tower. Interesting. And then we can go back to the top of the tower from here, which we don't need to go to. We could probably kill that bird again, which would be nice. I'm trying to see if there's anything around here. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe not. I, I just wanted to see if there's anything around there just for the sake of it, you know what I mean? You never know. There's something here, though. It's like shining on its tail. But it won't let us... Attach to it? Weird. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I think we're gonna go... Back down to the tower, maybe? I think that's probably best bet. So, what was... This? There's a little grating here. I see it. I didn't even see it before, but I see it now. Uh, maybe we can... I think we can make the jump over here. Okay, it's a little shortcut, but that's not going to help us with the, the grading part of this. Where did we see? I saw a... Oh, here. Did you guys see that? I mean, I'll take this. I don't... Is this the one I saw? I think it might have been the one I saw. There's also one here. But there's no, there's no roof on the. Oh, there is a roof on the thing. Wait. I know how to do this. I know how to do this. Hold on one second. Weird me now. We're gonna blow up this freaking cage. <laughs> Nice. There's a few more that I feel like we could get. Like, I don't know. I feel like there's a few more that we can get for sure. Um, first of all, let's fast travel to the top of the tower again. Um, I wonder if we can glide into the bird that's that's around here somewhere. I saw a bird somewhere. Was it around here? Or does the bird just randomly show up or something? Because, like, I saw a bird, but I'm wondering if it's, like... I hear the squawk. It's on there. Yeah, let's go get it. You ready? You ready to kill this? You ready to kill this thing? That's not going to do it. That's not going to do it at all. Hey, I'm a monster. I'm coming into your town. Quick. 
Okay, I'm not quite sure how to get the the. Maybe if we just go. Hold on a second. You can you can do whatever you want here. It's actually a really fun place. So you like these people. They're really nice. Um. The rocket won't do because apparently the rocket just takes us to a different world together. How do you get to that though? <laughs> That's going to be the bane of my existence for the rest of my freaking life. Maybe we should go under it regardless and see what we can do from under it. And then if not, we'll just go home. I think that's probably the fair thing to do. Because we have another world to explore as well. We have a whole other place to explore. I kind of like... I don't want to leave. This is such a great world. But now we have a cowboy outfit. We should probably show it off a bit. Yeah, because there's a uh, Jax over here. Oh, okay. I mean, I'll take the Luigi. Wait. That's really creepy. I thought if you maybe saw- Oh, there's something over here as well. Like a little hidden chasm as well. Mmm. How do we get to this? Hey, you, you come down there, eh? You come down there now. Oh, oh, hello. Hello. I thought there was a coin. Oh! <laughs> it's about to be depression hours. Uh, okay, let's go up and bring this up then. Wait, where the hell is this? No, pay oh. Is it gonna respawn in up here? I just wanna pick it up. Why is pick up the same button as throw? As hold, I should say. Why is it? Nobody knows. No, not what I wanted to do. You know it wasn't what I wanted to do, game. No. The game only literally follows what you tell to do. That's another thing I can never stand with, like, Let's Players. Game, I told you to press the, I pressed this. If you press the button, it would have freaking worked. If you press the button, it would have worked, my friend. Especially with a game like this, that is, like, so meticulously planned out and so smooth. I want to kill that bird. Really badly. I think I can kill it from up here. I totally could. Hold on a second. We're going back here in a second. This place is vibrating. We're going back here in a second. That's it's it's rumbling. I think if we maybe go leave this place and come back, this will like turn into like another power moon, which means we can like do this casually. Come back whenever, you know? But I it was rumbling. What are these little weirdo blocks as well? Little freaks. Little freak blocks. Oh, it's just... Okay. I thought we were going to fight a boss or something. Uh, we have a lot of power moons. Um, Should we wait up here for the bird to come around? To see if maybe we can get it. Jesus, man, I like how do they? How does one expect us to get up there? I wonder. Let's come from this side. Uh, yeah. It, oh, it's doing a full circle. It's doing a full circle around this place. There's two of them. I'm coming to get you. Now, Ruta run style. Honestly, in the next episode, we're going to be moving on to a new area. 
So as I always say to people watching this, there's Goombas with sombreros on now. That's really cool. As I always say to people who are watching my uh, my playthroughs, um, I adore you. Thank you so much for watching. And this is kind of like extra DLC stuff. So like if you want to tune out now and you're more interested in the other stuff, <laughs> you totally can. I'm not going to judge you. But yeah! Take that. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make one attempt before we go to do, uh, to try and maybe glide into the bird to get that our power moon. Right there, birdie. How you doing, bud? Um, it's all the way down there. But I feel like if we wait for it to come back around, look, it's come back around. Um, I feel like if we set her on fire or something, you can breathe fire, can't you? Oh, there's one down there as well. Is it the same bird? Yeah, I wonder if it's the same bird. And, like, we already got this bird. I think it's the same, the same exact bird. What do you think, buddy? Like, where is he flying to? Hold on a second. If we fast travel to the oasis... Oh, we can't fast travel over in the air. If we fast travel over here to this uh, desert oasis for a second. And wait for this bird to come around. Yeah, he's gonna come around this way. Yeah, so people tell me you can do a hat jump. I haven't mastered it yet. We might do it in the next 10 years. Yeah, he's coming around here. So we'll see if this is the same bird. Because that's definitely the same bird, the one we already hit. Yeah, let's see if we can get this. We don't want to get it to a point where we can't hit it or whatever, you know what I mean? Oh, here we go. No, we already got that one. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Cool. So they just respawn. Uh, let's warp back to the Odyssey. I'm finished here. For now, anyway. For now, I'm finished here. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, this has been just a really, really fun time. There's going to be a lot of, like, uh, episodes like this, I think. In, in fairness. So, honestly, like, I hope you... Oh, we can also add our moon switch, which is really cool. We got a lot of them. And I'll see you guys very, very soon. 58! Awesome. I think there's, like, 60 moons in the whole game. I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>